Hello everyone, are you ready for another Nuzlocke? I'm here to fight the police. What up, cop? Hey cop, leave a like if you like my videos. And you should do it to everyone else. Wow, this is a straight up- yeah, it's Officer Keith. Chief Keith? Growlithe? Oh, shit! <laughs> what the fuck? Jolene, run! I like that I ended last episode saying I'm not gonna use Kid Fisto as much. And then immediately. Immediately I need Kid Fisto. Please don't deal a lot. Okay, thank god. I mean, if there's a good chance that this Growlithe knows bite, in which case that will kill Kid Fisto. No, it won't. Oh god, Kid Fisto. Pop, 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 pop! Pop, pop! Killing him. Killing him softly with your words, Kid Fisto. Why the fuck was that cop so strong? Jesus Christ. Who just rocks a level 17 Growlithe right off the bat? You're a tough little guy. Well, later, cop. Keith. Don't trust no cop named Keith. If you're a cop named Keith, leave a like. Comment. Tell me how you, how it goes. Tell me why you only have a Growlithe in your team. Ah, anyway, we're gonna continue on. I'm a little excited just because of how easily uh, Kid Fisto kind of took out that gym last episode. <laughs> I really needed him to. Which is good. Alright, I think there's one more cop in here. There has to be at least. Hello! Hello, snake. No? No cop. Okay. I guess we'll go for it. I guess the cops are up. Yeah, the cops are up. They have to be up. Alright, let me go into my bag. Let me see. Where's my bike? Select. Bitchin'. Doop 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 doop. Oh. Just like that, it's gone. You know? Ah, oh, no. We have to go here. We have to go. Meow. Give me the mysterious water bottle. Yeah. Give me your squirt, girl. Thank you. I will now use your squirt bottle to take out all foes. Gross. Alright, let's move on. Actually, I think there's one other thing I need to do. But I need to see if I can find it. I want to say there's a way to get, like... No, I guess no. I think I'm thinking up above. So we'll go up above. Tell you, man, sometimes my memories of this game are perfect, and sometimes they're just a little bit off. Hello, Name Raider. Do you have anything for me? It wriggles. Hmm. Hmm. Is Jolene strong enough? Let's hope whatever you have is not strong enough to take down Jolie. Am I going to the gym? Girl, I just came back from the gym. Super powerful. Are you a lass? No, you're a, uh, you're a lady who likes to go to the picnic. What? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> Why is everyone rocking super hard to beat fire types? Oh man, I should go to Soul Rock, but... Hmm, no. We'll go Kid Fisto. The problem is that I don't want to put him in on a on an unfavorable matchup like that. Because that's just going to hurt us in the long run. Rank 2-5. No pop-pop. That's a kill, though, so that's a that's a crit. So that's a retroactive pop-pop. It's a strong pop-pop. And Jolene is now level 11. All right. Oh, man. No, you could not win. Let's see. Okay. And f wait. Girl, can I have your number? Okay. Apparently not. I have badges. You should check them out. We'll talk later. Um, we'll keep Oddish. I'm gonna show my girlfriend I'm hot stuff. Dude, I'm ready to cuck you in front of your girl right now. Let's go. You even take a cuck stance. And you sent out Sandrew? Zen, to be fair. Very strong Pokemon. Can Jolie take her take him down though? Let's find out. I'm pretty sure he shouldn't low slash by now. 
If he does, then Jolene is dead. He doesn't, though. Okay. I mean, I don't think so. Jolene, stop, please. Can you stop missing? Uh, stop. Stop doing that. Mm. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Whew. This is a live uh, reenactment of when Zen tried to read part six of JoJo. Not to spoil anything that goes on to it, just I remember he did not have the greatest time reading it. And though I think he said he still likes every JoJo part, it's just every JoJo part is in a different category in his mind. Oh, absorb. That's the funny thing, is that we, if we disagree, I really don't like Part 5 all that much. And he doesn't really like Part 6 every much, very much. And we're still both fantastic friends. It really goes to show you. Meryl! Um... Meryl's surely no water gun, right? Okay, good. I mean, there's a small chance that it knows rollout, and I think that will hurt Jolene a whole bunch. But... Wow, are you a special defense tank? That has to be what you are. That's the only sane reasoning in my head as to why. I only have 12. God, that Sandshrew really screwed us over. Absorb should not count as missing PP if you miss, by the way. I think that's... No, actually, I can't say that's... No, it, it is baloney because um, when Kid Fisto took all those mud slaps in the face... He very clearly took them all. He did not dodge them all, and that count as a missing move. I'm just saying. In all fair and love of war, if a move does not hit, it should not count as PP. It does no rollout. This is bad. No, it's not. Never mind. Meryl, what is your purpose? Besides being a low-rent Pikachu. Alright, Jolene. Wait, you get stronger with each rollout. So if you don't... Yeah, okay. No. Come in, Kid Fisto. I say, realizing that if I don't kill this thing by the time rollout's done, then I'm dead. Yeah. Oh, wow, I'm faster than it, too. Pop, pop! Pop, popping all over these Merrells. Alright, not bad, not bad. Let's go get you guys healed up now, I suppose. I wish you would have lost to me. Well, bro, let me tell you. Oh, hello, Todd Camper. Good evening. It's me, Todd. Got a minute? How are your Pokemon doing? My Psyduck's really energetic. <gasps> oh, man. That means he can never catch a Drowsy now. It's permanently locked away from him. Actually, technically speaking, his Nuzlocke should have ended when I beat him. I assume everyone's playing a Nuzlocke. And when I beat them, they have to go release their Pokemon. They just had spares on hand. <laughs> healing up the Pokemon. Alright, Jolene's doing pretty fine so far. Now that she's actually fighting Pokemon that are against her type, for once. I really want to train up, um... Uh, Solrock, because he's a whooper. But I don't know the best place to train him at the moment. There's just, like, no good places. It's... Johto's very weirdly built. Aw, oh, man, really? I've been getting Pokemon data off my radio. I think I'm good. I think you're bad, bro. Bad with capital B. Camper Ivan. Oh, no, wait. Ha! Ha ha ha! Oh, wait. Wait, no, you're a poison type, right? Because that's what fucked up, um... Yeah, that's what fucked up Jotaro. So, yep, here comes Jake, Shaky Jake. Jake is back, and he's angrier than ever. Of course you use Scratch, because you're a piece of shit, Diglett. You're one of the worst, penis-shaped motherfucker. Leech life. Damn right. First I take your life, then I take your wife. Come on, Jake. Don't get crit, Jake. Oh man, these things are too dumb to get hit by Supersonic. 
Yeesh, 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 yeesh. Not good, not good. But we're doing fine so far. N what? That doesn't make any sense. In what Pokemon economy does that make sense? Cover 18 HP. Scratch. Leech. Really? Now you're gonna growl at me? Also, Jake, why are you not faster than Diglett? You're supposed to be one of the fastest Pokemon in the history of the world. Or maybe I'm just thinking of Crobat, who's actually super fast, and maybe you're not fast yet. Oh, come on. Thank you, Leech Life. And Diglett was destroyed. Get out of my face. Jake got some EXP. Zubat on Zubat crime, huh? Oh, what? Why is this not- Oh, come on! This is some straight-up horse shit. Someone is holding back Jake. And I'm gonna say it's the media. Supersonic. Now, this is a very precarious situation where I don't know if I should continue to fight with Jake as is. Leech life. Does no damage. But it's okay, because I have bite! Um, but I'm confused. Please don't do a lot of damage to yourself, Jake. Ah, oh, damn it, really? Jake, buddy, you need to work on some stuff for you. All right, let me see. The obvious answer is mouse. I'm gonna bring in mouse. Go mouse. Cause mouse ain't gonna take anything from this leech life. And he's super type negative against this Zubat. Hyper Fang. Dead. One hit. Done. Thank you. Not bad, not bad. Let's see who's the last Pokemon here. Hmm, level 14, huh? Uh, Mudslap. So if he does try and pop pop on us, it won't matter because... Now he's weak. Nice, Mouse. Very nice. Mouse getting back at the fact that he, this bastard of a Pokemon, is responsible for us no having no Jotaro. I mean, it's not even gonna matter. He's not even gonna try pop popping off. You try and crit back, Mouse strikes ahead. Mouse strikes back. Mouse is just too strong, bro. Even though I don't use him all that much now. I give. You better give. Okay, let's see. Jolene's in good step. Jake is okay. Mouse is, you know, no need for Mouse to get into a battle right away. My boyfriend's weak, so I can't rely on him. Damn. All right, we know how this ends. Girl, please don't have a Growlithe, is all I'm asking. Oh, it's Pikachu. Um... Oh, I shouldn't have brought out Solrock. But no, he has quick attack and stuff, so I'm not going to risk it. Oh, this is some... This is... This is... I can see why this guy doesn't like his girlfriend. It's stuff like this that ruins a relationship. When you're double teaming. Pop, pop! Alright, that's an insta death. That's how we do it. You try to double team me, girl? Wrong. Kid Fisto said, go to church. Now Jolene is level 13. <laughs> And Kid Fisto's still level 21. Oh my, you're so strong. Alright, so... Are you gonna give me that number? Oh no. Oh, come on. Well, that's it for today's episode. I've weirdly gotten it in between a relationship and we've leveled up some Pokemon. So, until next time, everyone. Have a good day. And remember to leave a like if you end up liking this stuff. Because it helps me out. Alright, goodbye.